one. I just want to light this clip before we end up talking because it's so funny. This video is supposed to be about tolerance break, but yeah, I'm smoking. But I did take the tolerance break though. I'm gonna let you know that. Wow. <coughs> it is your girl city static and welcome back to my channel if you are new here welcome make sure you hit that subscribe button and join the goodie gang in today's video i'll be talking about my week long tolerance break now this happened about two weeks ago but i explained a little bit in my vma video if you did not check out i did go to the vmas i'm gonna link it below that's definitely above so i'm gonna link it above and below if you did not check it out so i decided to go on a tolerance break because of a lot a lot of reasons but before we go into those reasons make sure you like this video and subscribe and hit that bell notification thanks i decided to take this break because yo i went to colorado I, listen i know people be talking about they got that za they got that oh they got that I'm telling you, when you get in your cannabis straight from the dispensary, straight from the source, it is totally different, okay? Like, the weed that has like 30% THC in it actually does because it's fresh. By the time it come from wherever and come to you in New York or wherever you at, if you're getting it from out of state, the THC level has dropped. It's not as potent as before, but anyway, that, it, I I just had like a ceiling and I was freaking hitting it. I could not get high anymore. And I was like, F it, let me just take a week off. And during this week, so many things happened. So in this video, I'm going to be talking about how I went through this tolerance break, the symptoms that I felt. And just like my life during this part because... This tolerance break really changed my life. And hopefully you guys will get inspired to take a tolerance break from watching this. So without further ado, here's me taking a week tolerance break. Hold on, hold on. I wanted to do this at the end of the video. But fuck it. Today is my first day of my week-long tolerance break. Am I gonna go crazy? Why the hell am I doing this? You'll find out in the next episode of Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding, <laughs> keep watching. This tea is still too, too hot. If you think I'm drinking this right now, you must be mod. Let that cool down. So earlier I said that I'm taking a tolerance break because of I saw myself smoking a lot of weed and I also been consuming a lot of tobacco products. But also my lungs were compromised earlier this year. Yeah, I had that thing. I ain't gonna say it because they're really you're really serious about this uh demonetizing thing before saying it, and I'm not even monetized, so I'm not taking no chances. And also, I'm becoming very serious about this cannabis content that I've been pushing out. So I have to better the relationship with cannabis because like I could let it consume me. That's like you guys watching mukbangs. 10 out of 10, well let me shut up because um, I'm gonna say 8 out of 10 because there's some of them I know who be eating with that food all day. Mm -hmm. But 8 out of 10, those mukbangers that you see, they're not eating all that food, they're not consuming all that food. But just because you only see them eating in front of the camera you think they eat so much food and that's how i think about smoking because i don't want it to be up to a point where i have to smoke to be on camera i'm full of personality hella sober i do not need weed to bring that out of me but it's more or less i smoke weed for because i want to why do i need to explain that it's because i want to smoke weed because i choose to smoke weed 
But for real, I, I want to teach myself that I could do this cannabis content, but in moderation. And also, I want to lower my tolerance. My tolerance is so high right now, and it's worse because I've been smoking the same strain this whole time. I did start taking breaks in the middle of the day, so I had like hour breaks in between smoking, and I'll get like a little buzz, but it wasn't, it wasn't doing nothing. And also, the most important thing, and this actually got me the most excited, I'm not even gonna lie. When I started doing research, I learned about the end, end, endocannabinoid system. Do you know what that is? It has two words that you know. If you're a smoker, you should know these two words. Endo and cannabis. Well, cannabinoid, but still derived from cannabis. So it regulates your immune system response. It regulates your appetite and your metabolism. It regulates your memory. And it helps with communication between cells. If we overcrowd our endocannabinoid system with a whole bunch of THC, it's gonna slow down the receptors and slow down the job of the system. I was like, yo, that makes sense. That makes sense. Because how much are you going to have to smoke before you eat or after you eat to create an appetite? If you guys want to do your own research about tolerance breaks and if you're interested in taking one, I'm going to link down all the videos I watched um, last night. But now I'm going to enjoy this hot fire tea. Yeah, I'm going to enjoy this hot fire tea. And then we're going to continue the day. I'm going to let you guys know how I'm feeling, uh, what's going on in my mind, like what side effects okay well i'm um, just keep watching and um I ended up going to Prospect Park to celebrate my godmother's birthday and while we were in the park they had a traditional Trinidad carnival thing going on. You see one of the characters dancing here and then I also saved the bee. For some reason it just landed on my blanket like kind of in my food and I took that as a sign and I took care of it and you can see the vibes my mom was dancing. We had a lot of fun. <laughs> This part was a bit of a rant, so I'm going to simplify it. Day two was horrible. I did not record it because it was so horrible. Like, my anxiety was at an all-time high. And if you checked on the um, symptoms list that I showed early in the video, anxiety is one of the symptoms. Like, on a regular day, I got some anxiety, but not having the THC in my system to cool me down really drove me mad and then just the little inconveniences that kept happening just drove me mad too and I lost it but then I recentered myself and was like you know what we are gonna keep it pushing but then I was kind of feeling like that again the same day so the next clip you're gonna see what I did to make myself feel better alright so oh this is my I'm actually about to leave my house cuz I'm getting to that point again where I was yesterday and I'm like you know what I'm not gonna do it so I'm gonna find myself outside and get some vitamin D and I don't know what I'm gonna do I think I'm gonna ride my bike but I have to travel to get my bike because my bike is not my apartment and I don't want to walk around in my neighborhood I don't I don't so I'm probably just gonna ride my bike somewhere so I have to go to my parents house to get it but I'm not gonna allow I'm not gonna allow myself to feel like this again and I had to take a second to literally <laughs> pinpoint the issue and I pinpoint the issue and why I'm getting upset so I figured it out um and I'm just gonna go outside and just be outside because being in my house is driving me crazy it really is and it's not helping it's not helping with my situation at all so Yeah, I can't record and ride this back at the same time and I don't have my tripod. So, whew, I'm gonna catch you guys later. Surprise! What are you doing here? Oh, you can't see me. Surprise! My Xbox came. Look at him. Hey, handsome. Hey, Xbox came. 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 Hey, Xbox
<laughs> oh, that's my butt. Don't do that. Tell them how excited. Hi, monkey. Oh, shit. Hi, monkey down. Hi, monkey boy. Hello, you miss mommy. Mommy miss you too. Oh, my God. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Sit down. Fiend. 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 Right. I'm going to enjoy some time with my families. And I get back. back. I get back with y'all later. Cause this boy is demanding. Okay, okay. Shit. <sighs> I think this is day four, but I really think it's actually day three. I counted Sunday as a day, but I should have counted it after I hit the 24. And anyway, I'm still on my week-long <laughs> tolerance break. And I feel a lot better. Yesterday was so much fun. I rode around Brooklyn and I visited my boyfriend. I spent some time with my um, my family as well. Now I'm. I feel like I'm a lot more aware of myself. Um, I catch myself running like 300 miles per hour, and I take a moment just to ground myself. And when I take that moment, everything starts to feel a lot better. Uh, my anxiousness is still there, but I'm doing a lot better. I'm doing a lot better. And I know it's not going to last forever, uh, but it's just that when you're in the moment, it's the absolute worst. Um, but, you know, I'll overcome it. You know, I'm just happy I'm raw dog in life right now because we can't always keep a cloud over our mind. We have to deal with life up front. I don't think I'm going to... Um, I don't think I'm going to like make it past a week tolerance break like I'm really cutting it off at a week But it gives the opportunity for my chest to um my chest to clear up my chest have has been tight Especially yesterday when I was riding that bike That is the most exercise I did in the past two months. So it was really like it's kind of hard on my lungs Um, but I made it through I was able to go from point A to point B and back Um, but yeah, my chest i've been coughing but the coughing is definitely lightening up as the days go by but i'm coughing up this clear mucus it's like clear but it's thick but either way i'm getting it out of my system so yes yeah, so i'm actually now gonna go food shopping with my friend che you guys should know him if you've been with the goodie gang for a while he helped me move into my apartment so we're gonna link up and go to trader joe's but before that i'm actually gonna stop i'm going to check my local green grocers and i'm gonna pick up some produce there because usually like it's like some items um, at my local green grocer is cheaper than at Trader Joe's. So I just pick up some items there and then I pick up the rest at Trader Joe's. Hi, She had a nice big one. Tyler Perry did amazing. You know his wigs don't be that good. But this one is. Well, why she look like one of the um, Braxton sisters though? See, it's a good one. Oh, okay, frontal. Okay, frontal. You know it's so funny how you can tell it's a wig. Huh. It looks too perfect. Yeah, that's that. I don't know what day it is. And at this immediate present moment, at this very second, I don't care to what day it is. Like, I just feel like shit. I feel like shit mentally and physically. Like, yeah, shit hit me like a brick wall. I just feel like the withdrawal symptoms are like 20 times magnified with my cycle being here. And sometimes I would smoke to get the, um, the cramps you know, subdued, but subdued, is that even the right word to say? Man, I can't even talk right now. I'm so annoyed. I'm so annoyed. That is the end of that. That was my life on a week Tom's break. I hope this video encourages you to at least take a day or two from smoking. You know, it definitely does help out your mind, body, and soul. And scientifically, it is proven through our endocannabinoid system. I hope you guys learned a thing or two about that. Um, I definitely will be taking more tolerance breaks. I know it's going to be like a very time of my life, but... For my mind, my body, my soul, my spirit, my aura, my all that, I have no problem doing it. Um, I'll probably do like a challenge. I think I probably want to do a break before the year ends, so look out for that. 
yeah look out for that and if i didn't say already make sure you stream my new single ox okay the link will be in the description and thank you guys so much for watching make sure you like make sure you comment make sure you subscribe and hit that bell notification so you're notified when a video is ready for you to watch and i'm about to finish this splizzy and take it easy <laughs> i was trying to say easy but that wasn't it stay tuned because your gal coming back with more real soon Ooh, do you guys like my makeup? I forgot to say that in my other intro, but I think it's because I'm snagged. I'm feeling myself. How y'all liking it? My sister did my hair, by the way. Thank you, TT. I love you. I love you. And I love you for watching and sticking around through my madness. He's a real one. Why God? Wow. Why go on, goody? Goody, goody. Go stream my new single. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs>